3456789 Hello everybody, this is your captain speaking, Rafael Chacin, as no es el capitán Rafucho and right here I'm on the Charlotte, North Carolina because this is the week number one of Gamecocks versus North Carolina Tar Heels. I know it sounds weird because this is college football week. And I know that I understood it about the NFL, the college football, but yeah. So what are the things that I just interviewed some random persons about five wide receivers actually at the NFL and of course for the game Gamecocks versus Tar Heels of North Carolina. I know it sounds very weird, but that was unexpected. And I know that microphone was up during the last interview, so you gotta check this out, folks. So, roll beta tape, put it right there. Yeah, this is gonna be on TV. So, oh, let's go. Do you think that Gamecocks is gonna win against Tar Heels? I do. I do okay. think we're gonna win. Okay, so do you have a, like a strategy of defense, the quarterback? We've got to get to Drake May. He's a phenomenal athlete and a phenomenal talent, and we've got to get to him if we want to disrupt their offense. You say go Cox, baby, go Cox. I think that's a separating factor. Uh, I think SEC defense you can never bet against them, but I think the game Cox defense is going to be a separating factor because UNC defense is awful. So I think SEC game Cox defense is going is what's going to be the separating factor. I think. Rattler's going to hold it down, and their defense is going to be what's going to be separated back for them to win the game. Oh, so we got a Tar Heel fan right yes, there, sir. huh? Yes, sir. Tar Heels by 90. Do you think that Tar Heels going to beat the Gamecocks? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely not. Absolutely. Heels. Who do you think that Gamecocks are going to win against Tar Heels? So ask that again. Game cause is gonna win answer. against oh, Tark Hills. 100%. Cultural state, I'll answer. 100%. I understand all. <laughs> 14 point victory by the Gamecocks. Who do you think is gonna be like the most valuable player of that game? Juice Wells. Juice Wells? Oh. Juice Wells is gonna go off. Gonna have some couple big plays by Nick Harbor. Juice Wells all day. That's very fair. That's very fair. That's very fair. That's very fair. I like that point. I like that point. Radler for Heisman. Most valuable player to win at this game. Oh, the MVP? Uh, Sam Howell. Sam course. Howell? <laughs> Carolina. For me, it sounds fair, but what position? What position? Quarterback, Avi. All the quarterback, the most important position. I just wanted to tell you for, because you gotta name five wide receivers at the NFL, the current one. Mm -hmm. You gotta name wide receivers, the current ones. So you gotta name five. On? The wide receivers of the NFL, the current one. any wide receivers. Any wide receivers, okay. any wide receivers. Like Stephon Diggs, A.J. Brown, Jamar Chase, Justin Jefferson, Tyreek Hill. There's a, there's a lot of really good wide receivers. Wow, that's a good choice. That's a good choice. Yeah. Name five wide receivers at the NFL. Go. All right. The actual Easy money. Can I name them all? You want me to go any team? I'll go, you know, I'll go all Pittsburgh Steelers, right? Deontay Johnson, George Pickens, Calvin Austin III, Gunnar Rusevsky, and Miles Boink, and that's just Pittsburgh. Also, you're a Steelers fan? Die hard, baby, die hard. There you have it. There's like a Steelers fan right now, so I just wanted to tell you. Go Steelers. I got my hat for the Raiders. I got my hat for my Raiders, so. Hey, Immaculate Reception, 1972, December 23rd. Oh, come on, please. Oh, come on now. <laughs> All right. Jamar Chase. Oh, that's very interesting. One. Another two, another two. <laughs> Stefan Diggs. Bob McDonald. So, what do you think of Brock Purdy? I don't think I have any words to say. I think you know what I'm going to say. Do you think that the Philadelphia Eagles could win the Super Bowl against the, against the Chiefs? We could have. I have us going back to the Super Bowl and I have us winning it this year. Go Birds. I have offense and defense. I think we're going to go back to the Super Bowl and win it. He posted up in the, in the middle of the bar. No fucks given. Can I cuss? Okay. No blank given. My boy Raphael posted up. Shout out to Raphael, man. Hey, this, what he's doing right now takes a lot of heart to build nothing from something and I know all about it. So I'd like to give a shout out to my boy Raphael, man. He's doing that thing right there. Man. Oh man, what can I say about it? That interview was unexpected, but I know my microphone was f***ed up. I need to try to buy a new one. But sometimes they scream, they can really get a lot of things, but yes. That was unexpected, but 
everything can happen at the college football everything could happen at the college football so I just wanted to tell you so to everybody else this has been amazing adventure another video block which they're gonna fail for everybody else but I just wanted to say you thank you guys and I will see you there at the next time Rafael Chacines no es el capitán Rafucho I will see you there next time for another adventure peace out Okay, so right here I'm with the Tar Heels fans and one Clemson's fan. So, let's go. One, two, three. Oh my God. Oh my goodness, I, oh look at I see a lot And what a Tar Heel fan Hey, Cox by 90 though, Cox by 90 baby, let's go Cox by 90! See that? Everything can happen I don't care what he says, roll Terrapins From Maryland, roll Terrapins See that? See that? that? That's a happy game card fan. I don't know why you're staring at me. Because I look as like a weird. The college football at noon. Oh! That's all, folks. Hey, but that's my line. Can I go home now? <laughs>